Picture yourself stepping into an elevator. The doors close and you begin your ascent. Now imagine knowing that the entire elevator system is controlled by an AI, but nobody, not even its creators, fully understands how it makes decisions. Would you trust it with your life? This scenario highlights why mechanistic interpretability has become one of the most fascinating frontiers in artificial intelligence research. We're not just asking whether AI works, we're asking how and why it works, right down to the neural level. Think of a modern neural network like a car engine that somehow assembled itself. Sure, it runs, and it might even run perfectly. But if something goes wrong, we're left scratching our heads. Mechanistic interpretability is our attempt to take this engine apart, examine every gear and spring, and truly understand how each piece contributes to the whole. Let's break this down with a simple example. When you recognize a friend's face, your brain processes this information through billions of neurons working together. Similarly, when an AI recognizes a face, it uses artificial neurons. But until recently, we've treated these networks as black boxes. We knew they worked, but not how they worked. This is where mechanistic interpretability steps in. Researchers have developed fascinating techniques to peer inside these neural networks. One approach involves identifying specific circuits within the network, groups of neurons that work together to perform specific tasks. It's like discovering that certain brain regions process color while others handle motion. Remember trying to figure out a secret recipe by tasting a dish? That's similar to traditional AI interpretation methods. But mechanistic interpretability goes further. It's like watching the chef prepare the dish in slow motion, understanding exactly why each ingredient matters. Some breakthrough findings have emerged from this field. Researchers have identified specific neurons that activate when detecting curved lines, others that respond to color patterns, and even circuits that seem to perform mathematical operations. These discoveries aren't just academic curiosities. They're crucial steps toward building AI systems we can truly understand and trust. But here's where things get really interesting. As we dig deeper into neural networks, we're finding that they sometimes solve problems in ways we never expected. It's like discovering that your self-driving car learned to navigate not by understanding traffic rules, but by memorizing patterns and shadow movements. Technically effective, but not what we intended. This raises profound questions about AI safety and reliability. If we can't understand how our AI systems reach their conclusions, how can we ensure they'll make the right decisions in critical situations? How can we verify they're using reliable methods rather than clever shortcuts? Researchers use techniques like activation atlases, which create visual maps of neural network decisions, and attribution methods that trace the path of information through the network. Picture it like following a drop of dye as it flows through a complex maze of pipes. But this field faces significant challenges. Modern neural networks contain millions or even billions of parameters. Trying to understand each connection is like attempting to map every grain of sand on a beach. We need better tools, smarter approaches, and new ways of thinking about neural network architecture. The implications stretch far beyond technical curiosity. As AI systems take on more critical roles in healthcare, transportation, and security, understanding their decision-making becomes crucial. We're not just asking how these systems work, we're asking how to ensure they work for the benefit of humanity. Consider a medical AI that spots cancer in x-rays. It's not enough to know it's accurate. We need to understand what features it's actually looking for, whether its decision-making aligns with medical knowledge, and if it might have dangerous blind spots. The field is also revealing fascinating parallels between artificial and biological neural networks. As we develop better tools to understand AI systems, we might gain insights into how our own brains process information. It's a beautiful example of how studying artificial intelligence can illuminate human intelligence. Looking ahead, mechanistic interpretability might be key to developing truly aligned AI systems, ones that not only perform well, but do so for the right reasons. This could help bridge the gap between current AI capabilities and the dream of artificial general intelligence that we can trust and understand. But perhaps the most profound aspect of this field is how it challenges our assumptions about understanding itself. What does it mean to truly understand a system? 
At what point can we say we know how an AI works? These questions echo ancient philosophical debates about knowledge and consciousness. The quest for mechanistic interpretability reminds us that creating intelligence is one thing, understanding it is another entirely. As we build increasingly powerful AI systems, our ability to comprehend their inner workings becomes not just a technical challenge, but a philosophical imperative. As our elevator ride comes to an end, consider this. Every day, we're trusting more of our lives to AI systems. The work being done in mechanistic interpretability isn't just about satisfying scientific curiosity. It's about ensuring we can build AI systems that aren't just powerful, but trustworthy and aligned with human values.